See, it's hard for me to look at you when you're clapping. I want to look away. You know, does this little boy who was sent to the boarding school deserve your appreciation? See, that, that force moving me away? Then I notice it and I come back. And I don't want to come back. <laughs> you know? so, so anyway, those of you who need to go, well, let's take five, five minutes. And by all means, take off. And I'll stay and answer questions for half an hour if you want. Through till around 10.30. Okay, so I'm going to give those of you who want to go a chance to go. Okay, if anybody has a question, make sure it's one I know how to answer. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Well, let's let's let people go because then it'll be quiet. Yeah. Well, let it we'll let it uh, get quiet. No, I have it on my computer. It's on my something I didn't say, and some people are going to miss it, is that this therapy doesn't cure you in the accepted sense of cure. Many people feel tremendously helped, but it enters you into a way of life. Whenever I'm stressed, this stuff comes up, and I lie down, and I work through it. It's a way of life, and it's a journey that lasts for many, many years, but it's a lifesaver. Better to work with your stuff than to be going through life on mood elevators and tranquilizers and being mean and nasty to your kids. And, but I should tell you, it is a way of life. Yeah, that's important to know. So you become more sensitive, and the more sensitive you become, the more easily you get hurt and the more work you have to do. But, but there is a, a, a point where I think I know for me, I'm just so glad. I don't know what I would have done in my life if I hadn't discovered this. All right, any questions?